Hi, hey, yo, Carter Leo, and this is Vika. How are you today? I'm good, and you? Very good. I'm great too. Thank <laughs> you very much. Today, as you can see, we got jack o' lantern. It's almost Halloween, so I'm gonna teach you guys how to make a basic jack o' lantern. It's pretty traditional for、uh, families in the United States to carve up a pumpkin and make a jack o' lantern. My dad used to do this for us when we were little. But his jack o' lanterns were super, like, it's almost like art. They were really intricate. But today, I'm just gonna kind of teach you how to make a super basic jack o' lantern, okay? So let's start out. First, you need this pumpkin. In Japan, it's really hard to get a pumpkin this size. This is actually the first time maybe I've seen one, let alone bought one.、Um, And the price is pretty expensive compared to America. I think this, this guy was about $16, which I thought, whatever, it's once a year. <laughs> Let's just go ahead. Let's just go ahead and get it. Yeah. So, okay. So, first you need the pumpkin. Yeah, we got that. Next thing you'll need is like a pen or a pencil, because this is what you're going to use to draw the design. On the pumpkin with. Okay? Of course, you need a knife and a spoon. I guess we're, we're using a ladle today. <laughs> spoon and a bowl to put all the inside of the pumpkin into. Okay? Now you can see on our pumpkin here, when I bought this at the store, these stickers were already on here, which is, which is okay. You can use these as a design.、Um, But a lot of stores just have the pumpkin without the, you know, without the stickers. It'd look like this. So, how would you draw a design? Well, you could draw it freehand, which some people do. But a lot of people also they use a pencil and a piece of paper and they draw their design on the paper first and then maybe stick it on here on the pumpkin with, with tape and, and then they maybe poke holes. Along the, the border of the drawing and then cut it out afterwards. But today, I think I'll just kind of use this basic design. The mouth the mouth might be a little different, which is okay.、Um, the reason for that is because I'm using just kind of a basic, this is like a, like a fish carving knife, not a fish carving knife, like a, well, a fish filleting knife. Um, which is okay. You can really use any knife you want. But on Amazon, I think you can buy some pumpkin carving kits where they're really used for like more detailed jack o' lanterns. Like, what did my dad used to do? He used to make pumpkins like witches riding on brooms and, you know, things like that. Things with a lot more detail. But today, We're just gonna make a like a face, okay? I'm just gonna go ahead and draw with your marker or whatever you have. Just kind of trace along the outside of these of these stickers, and it doesn't have to be perfect. Oh my gosh.、Um, I don't know. It's been, it's been quite a while since I've made one. Actually, the last time I made a jack o' lantern was probably a few years ago at school when I lived in Kawasaki for、uh, the art program or the art club at that school. Yeah, of course. Okay, so. There we go, we've drawn our very basic jack o' lantern on here. Take、mm. these stickers off. Okay. This. Okay. Here we go, Mr. Jack o' lantern, sir. <laughs> Gans are a lot. Well, that's what, that's what they say. I'm not sure.、Um, I just looked up before doing this video on, <laughs> on how to like, cook the insides.、Mm. And they said, These bigger pumpkins, the seeds are okay. Like, you can roast the seeds. 
おお開いたちょっと中見てみよう、えー、おーすごいすごいすごいおー yeah, the brain. えーあー got the brain. でまあこの中は種とかが入ってるわけね、yeah. There are a lot of seeds in here and a lot of what we call pulp. That's this, this stringy, this stringy stuff. That's called、uh, pulp.、Huh? Pulp. Pulp. That's pulp. P U L P. That's like、uh, sometimes you drink orange juice and there's、uh, some stringy stuff in the orange juice. We call that pulp.、Uh, yeah. Now, the next thing we're going to do, and it's one of the last things, one of the last couple steps, is we're just going to cut out cut out the face, see how it turns out. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> okay, here we go. Again, just be real careful. Halloween Yeah. なんかそんな感じがあって、yeah, that's right. 私は子供たちのトリックオアトリートの方が好きだなって思うからさ、oh, yeah. やってるところもあると思うけどこの辺ないからねジョークのためにやってあげたいなって思うんだけどちょっとコロナがあるからね今年は yeah, probably,、うんね、でも来年できたら、ね、子供たちこの辺にもいるしさお年寄りのお家が多いけどさお願いしたらきっとやってくれそうだよね。I, I think they would. ねえ。Yeah, it'd be a fun activity for people in the community. アメリカではどうやっぱ若者のパーティーっていう感じがメインかやっぱトリックアトリーとか。No, trick or treat is the main. Well, it's actually everything. <laughs> I think when you're, when you're a kid, you look, you're really looking forward to, you know, trick or treating and getting all the candy that you can. そうだね。But, When, you're, when you become high schooler or college student. It's, it's got a deep, like a deep religious history. It started out, well, it's, it's called All Hallows Eve. And, well, if we just kind of fast forward and not skip all that, <laughs> skip all that stuff, it just became a. Just became a holiday、mm. where kids can kind of whatever dress up and. Kyle さんの今年の costume は何ですか英語教室であれだよね Halloween があるので Yeah, so we're gonna have a, a Halloween event at our at my English school.、Mm. Keys English.、Mm. Anybody's watching, you can contact us <laughs> and sign <laughs> up. <laughs> <laughs> sign up for that. But yeah, so we're gonna have a, a Halloween event. みんな子供たち仮装してきてすごいかわいいよね楽しみにしてるよねみんな Yeah and everyone's gonna dress up and well at least I hope so usually the kids do and this year I, I never really know what I'm gonna do what I'm gonna be for Halloween I always wanna be like Batman or Spiderman or something but those those costumes they're so expensive あと顔隠れちゃうからねレッスンできないもんねあとめっちゃ熱いと思うよ And, <laughs> and it's like, I don't know. I'm only going to wear that once a year for like、yeah. two hours, and、mm. I'm going to spend $200 on a costume. It's just not my thing. Some people do that,、mm. which is fine, but I just it's、ね、I can't bring myself to do that. Dream costume.、ね、so, yeah, <laughs> it is. It's my dream costume, Batman. But so this year, Vika, she actually just. Told me today. <laughs> She said, I think I found a costume. I said, okay. So she sent me the information. And it's a, a American football referee, which I can do. That's easy. <laughs> That's really easy. And it's cheap. <laughs> and it's authentic. <laughs> yeah. And if some kid, like I have a whistle, 
and a flag. <laughs> so if some kid like does something stupid in class, I can blow the whistle <laughs> really loud in their face. I feel like I'm Kick them out of the classroom. <laughs> What's he gonna be? Captain America. He's gonna be Captain America? Come on, that's cool. I got this at Eon. It's a supermarket that's just. Well, it's kind of near. It's near our. Main station in our city in Toyota. Yeah. But I was looking at it, the size was like $2,500 or $3,000. It's cheaper. If you compare it to America, I don't know. I asked my mom the other day, and she said a pumpkin about this size was about the same price, like $15. So. Yeah, I was, I was really, I was kind of surprised about that, actually. I mean, yeah. <laughs> 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 there, there were only four. And I'm interested, maybe I'll go back, like, this week and see how many are left. There are probably still only three left. Yeah. No, 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 I'm not going to buy any more. Because that's, like I said, it's a bit, a bit much. Yeah. I got the nose. Okay. See? One more. I just got the mouth. This is the big the big one. <laughs> uh, no. No. <laughs> yeah, I did. It's like it's just it's nothing special. Well Yeah. And I we always went with friends because I think, especially, of course, being a parent now would understand that. Mm. You should probably go with a group of friends because mm. it's better to go with a group than mm. by yourself. Of course, our town was really small, so everybody knew everybody anyway. <laughs> oh, that's a good question. I, I think people get seem to get upset when they see like a junior high schooler. Yeah, when they see a junior high schooler coming to your house, to their house, and like trick or treat, and they're wanting candy, they're just like, okay, it's time to give it up. <laughs> like these are for, these are for little kids. And I, I, I remember one year I had to take my brother, Kevin, around trick or treating, and and I felt, I kind of felt bad because. Even just taking them because I was already, I was already in junior high school at the time. Mm. <laughs> so I'm like, is it okay for me even to be seen, <laughs> kind of be seen doing this? I, I didn't know. So I kind of just let him do his thing. Yeah, I think it depends on the school, but a lot of a lot of schools. I think my school kind of yeah, they did a Halloween event, but of course, yeah, of course, but. They had to be careful about what costumes they could allow at school. If it was too, too bloody or too, oh. you know, grotesque or no, 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 no. yeah, that no. if it's too much, and of course it has to be school appropriate. So then, yeah, yeah, at the school, which is that's a no-no for <laughs> <laughs> Japanese schools, but. <laughs> Yeah, I don't, my family never really was big on the Halloween decorations, mm. but my, we did, we did carvings and stuff, pumpkin carvings like this, but mm. it was never, like, some people go crazy, like, it's almost like their house is a haunted house. Ah. But we never went, really went that, that crazy, you know? See this? That's his teeth. <laughs> you notice he doesn't have any teeth anymore. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> He's just a super smiley guy. So yeah. It's okay. No big deal. It's definitely it's not not scary at all. But you can see 
Yeah, there's still some stringy stuff in here, so the pulp. So you just kind of take that off with your knife, cut that out. <laughs> oh man, this is. Yeah, there you go. Yay! Oh. Right, like that. Ah, See? Yeah. And then on the inside, mm. which I'll show you guys right now. So the last thing you want to do, mm. and what a lot of people do, is they actually get real candles. Mm. But that can cause fires and stuff. Yeah. So you don't want to do that. So what we have are these tea light. These lights, you can get them at. Where did you get these? Just at a 100 yen store. Mm -hmm. Turn them on like this. Mm. And put them in. I think this guy's gonna need two. He's pretty big. So, we'll go ahead and put two in. Okay, that is the super basic way to carve out a pumpkin with no teeth. <laughs> <laughs> supposed to have teeth, but now it just depends on whatever you want. But yeah, go ahead and try it out. If you see a pumpkin, a big pumpkin like this at your supermarket, or if you know where to get one, try to get one and have a good time with your family. It's really, it's a really fun experience, I think. Yeah, your kids will really like it too, I think. So. All right. Thank you very much. See you next time. Bye. -bye.